Um, what's up, YouTube? I'm here with another video. Um, it's about heaven. And, um, okay. So, I'm gonna just tell you what heaven means to me. I, I can't, I can't explain. Look, look, YouTube. I can't explain to you what heaven really is because I've never been to it. I can't explain to you what hell is because I've never been to it, you know. Um, I'll just tell you what the Bible says, okay? Okay, so it says, it says, Isaiah 25, 8 to 12. He will swallow up death forever. The sovereign Lord will wipe away the tears from the faces. He will remove his people, disgrace from all the earth. The Lord has spoken. In that day, they will say, they will say, surely this is our God. We trust in him and he saved us. Okay. And then it says, the hand of the Lord will rest on this, on this mountain. But Moab will be trampled in their land as straw. This is trampled in the miniature. Okay. Okay. Um, and it says, Matthew five seventeen to 20, for I truly tell you until heaven and earth disappear, not the smallest letter, not the least stroke of a pen will by any means disappear from the law until everything is accomplished. Therefore, Anyone who sets aside one of the least of the commands and teaches others accordingly will be called least in the kingdom of heaven. But who practices and teaches these commandments will be called great in the kingdom of heaven. For I tell you that unless your righteousness surpasses that of the Pharisees and the teachers, of the law you will certainly not enter the kingdom of heaven it says in Matthew 7 13 to 15 enter through the narrow gate for the wide is the gate and the broad and the road that leads to destruction which is hell and many enter many will enter through it but enter but small is the gate and the narrow the road that leads to life, heaven, and only will few will find it. Watch out for false prophets. They come to you in sheep's clothing, but inward they are ferocious wolves.